Hello and welcome to God's Minute. I'm Pastor Jonathan Conrad. I'm the senior pastor at St. Paul's Lutheran Church in Wilmington, North Carolina. This week we're doing simple math, the numbers that mean something to me and I hope mean something to you when you hear them and their significance when it comes to the story of God. Today we are going to talk about seven. So let's get to the reading from Genesis. Thus the heavens and the earth were finished, and all their multitude. And on the seventh day, God finished the work that he had done, and he rested on the seventh day from all the work that he had done. So what does seven mean? First off, it means completeness and perfection, kind of like the number 12 that we talked about yesterday. But what seven means to me is rest. Rest like we see God resting. God has worked hard to form the world, and God finds it important that on a significant day, the seventh day, he rests. That's why we worship on the seventh day, because we are taking time from our busy lives to pause and rest and re-energize and focus on God and give thanks to God for all that he has given us. It's also a time for us to slow down. During this pandemic, a lot of us are busy. A lot of us are filling our time with work, childcare, maybe both, or some of us are constantly worried and caring for others. It's very important that we rest. It's very important that we find ways to re-energize. Maybe it's having a movie night or just saying no to your telephone for one day or no to the internet for a weekend, but finding that respite finding that time away from your calling so that your body can recharge. Because you and I, we do not do anybody any good if we're only going through life with half the energy we should. What is your rest? What is the way that you can find the rest and the energy to get back to, to full energy? Because even God rested. It's also one of our commandments. Keep the Sabbath holy. If God finds rest that important, we should too. Thank you for joining me. I will see you tomorrow for another edition of God's Minute. Take care.